And Ramla from the from Saudi. Uh, sir, if a woman uh, before her next period gets some uh, blood spots or really little bleeding, so is it her period? If this blood is coming after almost nine to ten days of her previous uh, period. Okay, I will answer you, Sham. Barakallah fikum. Ramla from from Saudi Arabia. Uh, she says, if I before getting the period uh, get discharges, so. I get the cramps, I get the back pain, and I get colored discharge, sometimes a spot or two of blood, maybe a thread of blood. Do I consider this to be part of my menses and I stop praying? Noting that this starts nine days after my previous menses. The answer is, it doesn't matter when it starts. What matters is that the discharge, the color discharge that you get before your period is not menses. But the color discharge that you get during your period or after it, before seeing purity, this is part of your menses. So a woman sees a thread of red line or a spot or two of blood or brownish discharges before her period. We say every adhan, go clean yourself, perform wudu and pray, you have no problem. This is najis, breaks your wudu, but it does not stop you from praying. Then after three, four days, she gets her period. Because the period is known with the flow of the blood. If the flow of the blood did not start, you disregard the colored discharges. Once the flow of blood starts, this is your period. You cannot end this period until you see your purity. So after five, six days, there's no blood, but there are colored brownish discharges. These are your period still. Until you see your purity, which is recognized by a white thread-like discharge, or by total dryness, nothing, no colored discharge, no colors at all. Only then you can have ghusl and start to pray, and whatever comes after it, it doesn't matter, and Allah knows best.